friends welcome back to my channel since last class we've been were discussing on work and travel in canada with international experience to canada become candidate in one of the express uh, international experience canada iec pools and get an invitations to apply and apply for work permit up so if if you are uh, new to this video please uh, go back and watch my part 1 part 2 that's when you will understand because this is a continuity video so we have discussed a uh, uh, lot of other process in the same um, express entry profile or uh, iec that is how to apply for the applications process at glance and how to participate in iec how to pull um, how the po poll works these are the topics that we've been discussing continuously and how to prepare your travel arrival extend your visa or iec participations round of invitations and get help from the recognized organizations some of the topics we already detailedly discussed and most of the topic is still pending in this class how much ever it is possible i'll try to give you informations if not we can continue for the upcoming classes too so last class we have discussed our hub about the process and who can apply today we are going to discuss detailly about how the po the pool works and um, uh, before getting into video please do like my videos and share this video to the people who are looking for canada immigrations or iec programs and uh, subscribe my channel that will be helpful for me and you can also give me the feedback uh, how this videos are helpful for you and if you want any information regarding the international pathway so definitely uh, give me in the description box um, i will do the research and try to give you the your favorite countries um, pathway thank you let us get into today's topic normally your profile will stay in the pool uh, until you receive the invitation supply for work permit and uh, there are two chances that they may get uh, removed from the portal uh, that is the end of the season or the if you are no longer um, eligible for the IEAC, IEC and we are uh, regularly issue the invitations candidate in the IEC pools during the IEC season. We have to check the schedule. We'll do that later. And when when the round of invitations for each country and category will start and end, the number of candidates pools and the ch chances of getting the invitations uh, season. The, those are the informations. If we can click it, we'll get those informations how we issue the invitations and apply international uh, as we have uh, discussed this topic too in a previous uh, video in detail you, you go back and check that that international co-op internship and young professionals and working holidays you have to have um, uh, eligibility criteria that you should be under uh, between 18 to 35 and then having international passport holder so we'll get the uh, uh, check schedule by clicking here so this is the check schedule um, you sh must be having any country of this listed one should be having a um, passport that's when you are eligible to apply for i'm going to select portugal because i get a lot of portugal uh, job experienced people who are having a passport is looking for uh, <coughs> any of these three programs so i just check everything but one by one will try working holiday i just go ahead and uh, click go you will get complete informations in regards to that number of on the page are normally updated on friday so the pool is open now working uh, portugal working holiday there are 1750 quotas are available and first round invitation is already given in the month of uh, january 17th and to be announced the final round is still pending and uh, invitation issued 1013 uh, people has already issued uh, this invitation and spots um, available is 1140 spots are still available and candidates in the pool is only 18 so that is what is the excellent news is chance of uh, receiving an invitation in the ex uh, next round is 17th june it is already 23rd so dates of invitations the quota date the first final round invitations will be updated this information becomes available so we'll again go back and check which are the uh, uh, countries are open or uh, eligibilities again i'll go back and check only the portugal country 
uh, young professional number of on the pages normally updated only on Fridays so you should keep checking on the Fridays um, today is Friday actually so I'm, I'm able to see this information here and young professionals there are 200 quotas are open and first round of invitation is uh, as I, we have seen on Ju uh, January 17th was announced and the final invitation is it yet to be announced and invitation issued for only for, uh, uh, 45 and spot available 180 still and uh, candidate in the pool only one is there for this young professional if you are eligible you can apply so you will get updations we will again go back and check uh, another option also is there so Portugal and international co-op inter internship so this also the quota is 50 is available and every Friday they give the updates and uh, weekly weeks on January 17 and to be announced and invitation issued 6 um, and spots available 46 more and candidates in the pool is 0 so no one has applied here nobody is there in the pool it is an extraordinary opportunity that you few hold an international passport if your age is below 40 or 35 you are um, having a great opportunity to visit uh, Canada and look for job I'll again go back we'll try looking for other countries like um, France uh, I'll check Germany work holiday okay see from Germany working holidays uh, quotas is 4490 is there already 5325 got invitations and um, uh, only 18 people are in um, uh, pool so it's an uh, it's already um, it's a great uh, opportunity that if you are looking for such one and you can keep checking whichever the country passport that you hold and it's going to be useful for you to apply for i hope this uh, information is uh, useful for you guys mm. find out your eligibility that we already have seen and I just wanted to show the document list I'm looking for get all the documents that you need using the personal checklist uh, gather all your documents uh, document list are like you know uh, your passport if you have um, like you know financial statement that they are looking for Canadians dollars 2000 five hundred dollars support yourself to be there in the three months in uh, Canada and all other basics documents that you should be having IELTS test results if you hold and best results if you already have these are the basics documents that you have to have with okay that's all for the day friends do like my videos and subscribe my channel for more updates next class we will discuss how to create a port uh, I mean profile in IEL IEC portal and uh, get invitations how to apply and after you apply what is the complete process we'll uh, discuss in the next next class uh, for continuity please follow us on all the social media uh, social network and follow us on uh, youtube too subscribe and hit the bell button for more updates thank you and have a great day bye